Hope you don't mind me just hanging out with you. Oh, you like the camera? You know about the camera. John's got a camera, huh? Nice foggy morning, huh? You know, I got a little filly named She's Cheeky who does that. Looks like you've done that a few times. Is everybody spoiling you? Kinda? I'm really sorry I didn't bring you anything this sent out. <laughs> they don't spoil you around here, do they? Hi, Zenyatta. Nice to see you. I don't really have anything for you today, except myself. I'm a fan, been a fan, will always be a fan. I call you the greatest thoroughbred anyone's ever seen. Physicality, consistency, and I understand personality. I understand personality-wise, you're, you're quite the character. Have you been around her since the beginning? Uh, about a year now. About a year? Yeah. Oh, no, she is Something special. Something special. She looks like a sweetheart. She definitely is. Your sweetheart, huh? That's that's important. Yeah. <laughs> Very important, Zenyatta. I really appreciate get meeting you finally. And I'm actually going to touch greatness for the first time you can you oh you bit me you take some blood I don't care you didn't really bite me did you you just took a little you just took a just a little thank you son. <laughs> I'll never wash that hand again sorry I didn't bring anything next time I promise you whatever what do you like carrot cake I once saw that on one of John's videos. She had a cake or something. Did she eat it? I don't know. Yes, probably did. Okay, well, Zenyatta. I call you the great and powerful one. I can see why. Before she goes to the track, she'll walk again. Is this her deal? Yeah. Is she a little spoiled, you think? Oh, yeah. Just a little bit? She's done enough to be spoiled? I just wanted to know, Zenyatta, if you gave Zardana any uh, tips on how to go back there and kick some Rachel butt. Nah, she didn't. She just kind of can do it on her own, huh? This is Zardana, the Rachel Slayer. We call her the Rachel Slayer. Thank you. This here is Zardana. We call her the Rachel Slayer. You kind of bummed out that you're not going to get to run against her? Doesn't seem like she really cares. She goes, I never got into that hype. Just give me any, just give me a racetrack and give me a field and I'll beat them. You know, Zenyatta, my five favorite Zenyatta moments from five on up would probably be, five would be your debut. Just the fact that you passed 10 horses, like in a wink of an eye, or was it more of a blink of an eye? John told me about you about 10 months before you made your debut. He showed me a photo of you on his phone and said, you know, if I get this filly to the races, she's gonna be something special. And uh, that just proved you can win at any distance. I think my fourth and third favorite Zenyatta moments were the Del Mar races, the Clement Hearses. The first one, you were just that move you made. Second, and the third one was the last one where you just got up on the wire. You had a lot of people scared for a second there. They wanted to blame Mike Smith. Uh, I just think you guys were having fun, giving people a semi-heart heart attack. My second favorite hey. Zenyatta moment was... Uh, the apple blossom. Yeah, the move you made on the dirt that day. You went by that champion ginger punch like she was tied to a post. And then obviously the favorite of everybody was the Breeders' Cup. What do you think about that? Looked like you had too much to do there. 
but not really. What well, pretty easy. Okay, Zenyatta. Thank you for your time today. Maybe I'll catch you on the track if it's not foggy later, okay? Okay. Do you know who I am? I am the great and powerful Zenyatta. And this is my, oh, look at that. Which is an absolutely well put together machine, ladies and gentlemen. Kids.